did some good for you guys, you know, gets help, help your body heal up a little bit and also get some more study time? Yeah, uh, study time is a big thing. Really the body healing part. I mean, we've only played one game so, so far, so luckily most guys' bodies feel just like we started camp. So, but it definitely helps for the studying aspect. You guys coming up a nice win against Wisconsin. Obviously, you want to keep it going, and then you're going to end up starting the year against three opponents who are, who are ranked. UCLA playing well, one of the top offenses in the country. What are you seeing from them on film? Uh, very fast, and to do well in this game, we got to be assignment perfect. It's a big thing, and really trust the person next to you that he's going to do his job, so you can do your job to the best of your ability. You guys were able to bottle up Monte Ball pretty, you know pretty well against Wisconsin. You got another tough test against Jonathan Franklin. Any similarities or differences you see between the two backs? They're great runners. They're hard runners. They break a lot of tackles. Both of them are definitely top caliber running backs. So we really all just got to work together and, as I said, be assignment perfect. I guess the biggest difference will be the fact that UCLA has got a more mobile quarterback in Brett, Brett Hundley. How do you guys uh, adjust and adapt to that for this game? Uh, with mobile quarterback, it's it's huge on the D line that during our pass, pass rush we really got to stay in our lanes, and we got to know that we have to that he can move, and certain risks can't be taken, as with a more stay uh, stay in the pocket quarterback. Now, where's what, what's the level of confidence now for you for you guys coming out and just showing people that you can play like that and, and kind of continue this? It's a defense, a lot of confidence. Um, comes with the game you got to be confident but you also got to be humble I mean we know we tr we still haven't proven ourselves I mean one game is one game anybody can play well one game and just slouch on the next few and we really want to show everyone that our defense mentality is we swim to the ball we get to the ball and we really are a good defense you talked about the mental aspect a little bit there. It also seems when we watch you in practice, you guys are also loose as well. And that's got to be a big thing as well. Look, you guys are always having fun. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, the when you're up tight and you're bad, it tends to be harder to move around, which is big this week against a very fast offense. So that's a big part is we're staying loose and we're running around a lot. Now, UCLA is a team that the Oregon State has traditionally struggled against you know, for, for whatever reason. Uh, you know, what tells you that you guys can change change that trend this weekend? We're viewing it uh, one game at a time. I mean, really, I mean, you can look in the past. I mean, last year was horrible. You can look at last game. I mean, we did okay. But really, none of that matters when you come into one game. We're going into the 0-0. Zero zero. Hopefully, we're 1-0 at the end of the week.